In this tutorial, let's learn how to merge data frames using pandas. First, let's import NumPy as NP and import pandas as PD. First, let's create a data frame. Let's call this data frame 1, equal PD, PD is pandas. Data frame here to organize the data as a data frame. The first column will be ID and you have ABC and the second column, the name is price. One, two, three. Let's see this. Well, this is the table generated by our code. Now let's generate the second data frame. The ID is the column, but we don't start A, we start with B and you go until D. And for the second column is quantity and you choose the number six, five and four. Let's see. Well, this is the table. Let's merge the data sets based on data set one. The code is PD merger, the first data set here, data frame one, data frame two, and let's choose the variable ID, the variable that you will make the match. And how we choose left, why left? Because the data frame one will be the base. See that for index zero, the quantity is not a number. Why? Because for data frame two, there is no ID A. Now let's merge based on data frame 2. The code is the same. The only difference here is in how we put right instead of left. And let's see the result. First thing, see that there is no A ID. But the ID, there is the D. And for the price, it's not a number because we merge based on the right, the data frame 2. Now let's merge both based on data frame one and data frame two. Uh, the code, the syntax is the same. The difference here is instead of left or right, you put the outer in how here. Let's see the, the result. Well, see that we have for index zero, not a number quantity. And for index three, we have not a number here in the price. And I think this is the ideal merger because you wanna see the missing values. Just for comparison, see the original data frame 1 and data frame 2. Now let's see what happens if you merge your base of index and not variables. The code is the same, the only difference here, right index true and the left index true because we want to consider both index in both data frames 1 and 2. And let's see the result. Well, see that it is an undesirable result. But in some circumstance, like panel data, you might want to merge based on index instead of variables. See that the ID of the data frame one become now ID X, and the ID of data frame two become ID Y. Well, now there is this mismatch between IDs. See the values A and B, B and C, and C and D. This happened because we match based on index and not based on variable ID.